Welcome to I Suck at Skyrim, the show where you watch me play Skyrim with legendary mode enabled, and I die a lot. I'm your host, Jerkbed Jesterfeld. Yeah, yeah, that's it. Laugh it up. Anyway, uh, basic premise of this show is I'm going to try and play legendary Skyrim with as little mods as possible, and you're going to watch me die, and if you don't find enjoyment from that, what's wrong with you? Uh, so as you can see, I have alternate life mod, which allows me to start the game with the, uh, a different path than the beginning, the uh, traditional beginning. And I'm just going to uh, set this timer so I don't go over my limit here. And well, let's get started. Approach, my child, and choose where your new life shall begin. Did I come by ship? Nah. Home property? Nah. Too easy. New member of a guild? Nah. Patron of the local inn? Nah. Soldier in the army? <laughs> Whatever. Cool, cool seeing the bullet. I think that's the original opening of Skyrim. And seeing as I'm playing the alternate life mod, why would I want to start on that one? I'm an outlaw in the wild. I wonder if that means I start with a bounty on my hand. Huh. Vigilante of Stendor? Nope. Camping in the woods. Shipwrecked off the coast. I'm a vampire. The Necromancer. I tried to record a couple episodes uh, before this. Actually, this first episode, uh, we recorded the third time because the last time that I tried to record it, the game bugged out really bad. And I'm hoping that doesn't happen here. Uh, but anyway, I was attacked and left for dead. Hey, you know what? I think that makes sense. Although, Refugee from Morrowind would make sense too because I am a dark elf. Uh, I could just do Surprise Me. I think I'll just do Attack and Left for Dead. That leaves us with the most options. The light of hope shines even for you. Don't give up. Wow, you are very optimistic. Uh, considering the last two episodes I tried to record did not work out well. Uh, I'm in bed. I wonder if it's gonna start me out. Troll camp. Not troll camp. Uh, the giant camp. Use the bed. Wow. I was attacked and left for dead. Um, you're... I don't know where this is. But there's some guys hunting. Good for them. Huh. Is that a geyser or is it boiling water? I don't think it's boiling water because I don't think I've ever been hurt by hot water in this game. So I think it's safe just to walk over here. Wow, I have no idea. I think I'm going to try and head towards the uh, map marker that indicates there's a house this way. It's a giant camp towards this way too. Ah, we just are ready. Oh. Wow, they, they tied me up and left for dead. Wow, that is just, that's cruel. Let me just get out of that. You know, because I'm like, Superman! Urgh! I just busted out of those ropes that were not even on me. Ooh. Okay, another thing you should know, I have Hunterborn enabled, uh, because I thought about putting realistic needs and diseases on, which I thought would be kind of cool, but then again, then you have to eat, and you always end up with diseases that disable you. And I think Legendary Skyrim is hard enough without all that. And now I'm just wandering. I'm wandering. i got to pick a path and go there. What everybody says, pick a path, pick a path, and just go. I apologize for the poor sound quality. I'm poor, so the best microphone I could afford was like three dollars. I don't know, I'm just going the uh, same direction I was I came from, do I? I don't know. <laughs> At least there aren't any wolves out here. <laughs> uh. Oh look, and it was not incorrect. I think I know where that is actually. 
We'll just uh, cross this quick flowing river with ease. Or not. There we go. No luck. Looking for like a hatchet. But it's probably not gonna work. Mix water mill. Hey! A person! And they're not trying to kill me. Here for work? Get an axe and bring me all the wood you can chop. Um no. Not really. They kinda left me for dead. You could have a little more sympathy. Or not. Empathy? Sympathy? I don't know what you call it. Cotton flowers. Mmm, yummy. Those will taste great. Uh, maybe I can steal stuff from you? Oh, hey! Can I take it? Oh, I can! It must be the one she was talking about. Oh, I'm out of lockpicks. Ah, oh, hold on, let me, uh, let me equip that real fast. I'm not going to explain every mod that I have because we'd be here forever. Yes, I understand that. Since I'm starting up doing the tutorial again. I should probably turn that off, but I don't want to. This probably isn't going to work. Because... Yeah. Stamina is low, which may prevent you from sprinting. Yeah, I guess that's not going to work. I think it works with two-handed weapons. I have a mod that allows you to break locks. Anyway. Maybe I can get into this person's house and steal their stuff. Oh, I was wondering who was Ah, it's worker's house. So there's probably nothing in it whatsoever. Except lots of ale. Hello! Big chest. It. Another empty chest. Nord Mead! I can I can use that. It's too bad it went under the bed that I can't crawl. Nord Mead. Bed with a bowl. Funny, it looks like every other house in this game. Only more decrepit. Pheasant breast. Do you like a pheasant breast? It's a little joke, but obviously. Wait, so you're telling me they abandoned this place? It looks like it's abandoned. I mean, look at all the cobwebs. There obviously isn't anybody been working here for a while. So they just left all this cool stuff on the walls? Like, you could totally make a town out of that. Probably a horse pelt. Why anybody would skin a horse, I don't know. Alright, so we got some mead. At least now we can get drunk if we want to. And I'm assuming if I follow this road. Oh man, it's too bad you can't throw weapons. I mean, I'm pretty sure there's mods that allow you to throw weapons, but it just <gasps> sucks that you can't just do it. I'll try sneaking. You can't see me. I'm totally sneaking right now. Come on, you can't see me. Stop running away. I just want to crack your face open. And feast on the stuff inside. All right. Oh. oh okay. Aha. A wolf. I shall help. I'm certainly not going to die. Wow. This this weapon sucks. Hold on a second. I really need to do something real quick. This one. Really, I don't have anything. Wow. I don't have anything. Usually when you start, you start with like at least a couple of health potions. I just don't have anything. Stamina regenerates slower. Crap. Then I'm gonna die. This weapon sucks. Wow, that was an awesome death. Ground must be icy. That could be the only explanation for why my body slid so far away. Where am I? Oh, goody! Autosave. Thank God for autosave. This time we're going to sneak. We're going to sneak up on him. I have some blue flowers. So fair, it's facing my direction. Oh, we see me coming. Try sneaking up on the one going up the side of the mountain. 
I'll be able to skin him. And where's... Aw, oh, come on! You can't see me! The indicator says you can't. Oh, well. Need to get to town. Buy some stuff. I can sell this mead. Give me a bow and arrow. Then we'll be good to go. Just go out there and shoot some stuff. I used to be a warrior. I well, took an arrow in the knee, isn't that what the guy says? Oh, hello. Oh, you won't let go then! We'll try it for a second time! I'm just gonna smash you in the face until you die. Although it appears that your teeth are much more jagged than my crappy little woodcutter's axe. <sighs> wow! That, that death was rather unique. I literally, like, did a backflip. Like one of those horrible stuntmen in the old movies. You like punch them and they do a backflip. Oh, you hit me so hard, I did a backflip. Well, we're not getting anywhere anywhere fast. I just said the same thing twice. So let's try going this way. Oh, hello. Travelers. Travelers are nice. Come along, no more stops. We need to find our way to solitude. Why oh, do you want to find your way to solitude? Don't bother me, peasant. I've had a long journey and paid too much coin on these gifts to be late to Vittoria's wedding. Yes. I'll be relieving you of those gifts what? then. No! God help! I told you it's the wedding of Vittoria Vici, an extremely well connected merchant. Ha! Ah! 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 I blocked you! Ah! And that didn't do anything. Ah! I'm blocking. I'm blocking. You can't hurt me. <sighs> you know, blocking really is overrated in this game. I'm gonna... Just gonna put that out there. <sighs> and here we are back at the door. Or exiting the house. You know what, I think Solitude's this way. By judging by what that character said. So I'm just gonna go this way and die at the hands of the wolf again. Maybe the dagger would be better? I don't know, what do you think? Let's see, dagger does two. Woodcutter's axe. Oh no, wait, that's the point. Okay. Five on that die. Oh yeah, definitely ten. Now that's the value. Crap. Damage four. Damage five. So actually, yeah, the woodcutter's axe is a better weapon. And uh, if he's here, we're just going to sprint past. Because I'd like to get, you know, further than just this road. Yep, he's following me. He's following me. I'm just going to outrun him. Because I can totally outrun a uh, wolf. Ow. Look at this crap. He's biting me in the butt. Ah. Good thing he's not following me anymore. Generate my stamina. What's that? Just see. Ah, oh, okay. The fog. Yes, the fog was covering it. Couldn't see it through the fog. So it only appeared to be hovering in midair. Those four. That roof. Oh, hello. Kajit. No, not Kajit. Lizard person. Hello. Greetings, brother. You look weary. I have something to help you relax, if you're interested. Wait a minute, you're not a Khajiit. What do you got for sale? Take a look. I will look. Sleeping tree sap. What is that for? Ooh. Wow, it's too bad I don't have any money, huh? Skuma. 62? Moon sugar. Why does the moon sugar cost more than the skuma? Doesn't that mean you're losing on that? Because don't you make skuma out of moon sugar? I guess it's because it's three, but even then, three, six, that makes no sense, dude. No wonder you're living out in the middle of nowhere, mm -hmm. in a cave. Oh wait, there's no cave there. You're just, so you're just walking along the highway. <sighs> Stupid Argonians. Oh, hello, little fox. What did the fox say? He's going to say death in a second. Come here, you. 
Did I hit it? Oh, where'd it go? Come here. I'm thinking, and I might make a rule on this, that I have to talk to every single person I meet. It's just, if it's possible to talk to them, I will talk to them. Um, I will try to kill everything that I see. But, you know, I'm not going to waste a lot of time doing that. Because, obviously, the fox can outrun me. I don't have a bow and arrow. Come here! Come on! I just want to smash your face in. And feast on the goodies. How is it I could get ahead of you, but then you just sprint away? I guess it's because you're an animal of the canine variety. Is that what it's called? Or canine? Well, there's a traveling salesman. Or I think he's just a carriage. My name is Alfarin. Alfarin. How's it going in there, eh? You're doing good there, just sitting in the cold. I'm gonna have to cut this short, people. Thanks for viewing my channel. Uh, if you enjoyed, please subscribe. And if you didn't, like I said before, why not? Tell me what I can do in the comments. Thanks again for your view. Bye bye! <laughs>